This is a true story. My wife crashed her car a couple of years ago. Lucky for us, the accident was the other guy's fault. Other guy's insurance had to pay for everything. One of the things that happened, my wife had trouble breathing out of one side of her nose. Doctor says that's from the airbag and I can fix it, but in order to straighten the inside of your nose, I need to straighten the outside. Well, because somebody else is paying. Free nose job out of this car wreck. I said, honey, did you tell him about how the airbag flattened your chest? <laughs> Made your lips all thin, your ass swell up. It... I'm pretty sure those are all airbag related injuries. You should have seen her before the crash, Doc. She was hot. I have pictures in this magazine. Make her look the way she did back in March, please. My wife had this surgery. Very scary to go through. They have a pre-surgery interview. Nurse finds out I'm a comic. Next question she asks my wife is, do you do any recreational drugs? To which my wife replies, no, he's not that successful yet. Day of the surgery, they got her in a gown, but they haven't given her any drugs. She's cold, she's scared, asking me questions. I don't know the answer, right? But I'm a good husband, so I'm making stuff up. She goes, how come I have to take off my underwear just to get my nose straight? I think in order to make sure it's straight, they need two other central points of reference on the body. They're lining you up with a big yardstick, honey. Either that or the doctor used to be in construction. And he's going to tie off a string and pop a chalk line. You don't want to get chalk on your panties. Okay? Finally, anesthesiologist comes in and starts shooting my wife up with uh, happy juice. This isn't just a little bit of morphine. This is a pre-surgery cocktail. When he's done pushing down the plunger, he looks at me and goes, the stuff I just gave your wife, she's going to pass out in two minutes. Until she does, she's going to be so relaxed that she wouldn't lie to you about anything. We call it the truth serum. It's usually fun for couples. I'll leave you two alone. i got two minutes to ask my wife a question. I know she's going to be honest. First thing that pops into my head is, have you ever cheated on me? Right? I thought, you know what? There's some things I don't want to know right now. So I figure I'll come in easy. I go, honey. She goes, yeah. I guess since we've been married, have you? You know, faked an orgasm? She goes, oh yeah. But don't worry, it wasn't with you. You guys have been fabulous, Dave. Enjoy share. Thank you.